Let's make this Excel dashboard with a chart and slicers in less than two minutes. My first step is getting my data, so I'm gonna hit Export CSV from on the clock, and then I'm gonna open it. Practice along in the workbook in my bio. We're going to select all of this data here because this is what we want in our pivot table. So insert a pivot table and let's do a new worksheet. We want to see the total hours by date. So we're going to put hours in the values to get a sum and then we're going to put date in the rows. So now for every date, we see how many total hours were worked for each employee altogether. Then go up to the top and insert a pivot chart. Let's go with a clustered bar and hit OK. Then we don't want all these headings, so let's right click on here to hide those and we can click on the title and delete it and click on the legend and press delete. Then let's go back up to the top and let's change the style of this. There's lots of different options here, but we could go with a light gray background. Next, we need the actual slicer. So let's go and insert that. And now we want employee name. We wanna see a list of employee names so that we can click on each one and further separate those total hours. Again, let's change the style on this. We could go with any color you want. And for now, we'll just move it over to the left side here and resize down. And then let's make this more of a dashboard and go up to view and uncheck grid lines. We don't want grid lines on here. Then of course, for a dashboard, you're gonna need a title. So let's title this something that makes sense. And because we're not filtering or doing anything like that, we could use Merge and Center. And then let's do some formatting, change the font color, background, size, all of that really make the title stand out. And then let's move all of this in place. We're going to cover right over our pivot table so this looks a lot nicer. Resize so now you can see all of the names in full and test it out. You can filter by pressing each button. There you go.